I want to talk about my personal experience and my opinions of the schools I visited. None of them are negative, which I want to point out. I was going to go to community college um, personally. I actually did sign up. I got waitlisted, didn't get added in, and I was like one of the last people on the wait list. So my chances of getting in were pretty slim. And I didn't want to have to wait, like, and I didn't want this to keep on happening, where if I got signed up for a course, I would literally have to have gaps in times where I would go. I think learning all of it is really important, but be realistic about it. So I started touring, like, a month before where I really wanted to attend. I still have, like, 20 days before I really want to, I'm going to start. Um, I researched into schools closer to me first. I live, um in a place where there's not too many, there's actually just a couple by me. I researched into them so many bad reviews for a couple of them. And I did actually try getting in contact with one location. They never even got back with me. And I thought that was first really unprofessional, you know, that they, I sent multiple emails and they never really took the time to get back to me. Um, But after my research, I concluded the locations closer to me weren't that great, except for one. So the one that I visited personally, um, Marinello, and you know, I thought Marinello was honestly, I was thinking when, like I told you, you need to go into this with open eyes because if I was just going to Marinello and I was like, okay, this isn't too bad. Like I, you know, I was thinking it was cheaper out of all of them. And I was just basing my thoughts on money and I was ready to sign the papers right when I went to my tour. I really got along with the people. Um, you know, the location wasn't so close to my house and, you know, I just wanted to start, to be honest. That's why I was like, okay, like this is it for me. Then one day, you know, like I went crazy researching and I saw that Aveda, Paul Mitchell, Tony and Guy, they're all like the same price. So I was like, and they're further away though. That's the only downside. So I was like, I slowly leaned myself into touring. I researched Aveda nonstop and I loved it. I was so certain that's where I wanted to go because their organic products, their, I had a coworker who went there, just so many great things that I researched. And you know, already I could tell it was a school that seemed to fit more my style. Then I was, then I researched Tony and Guy. It looked gorgeous. Um, I was like, oh my gosh. And my friend's friend went there. And she loved it. She does crazy hair. She's gorgeous. Like, amazing, right? And I was like, okay, I'll, I'll turn it there too. And then eventually, you know, I realized, I thought the Paul Mitchell was like two hours away from me. It's like an hour. And I was like, okay, I'll go to Paul Mitchell too. Because of, um, you know, my coworker actually went there. And she loved it. So eventually, you know, I kept on going more and more. And the reason why is because I didn't want to regret just picking. If I just signed up for Marinello, I would regret it. And I'm not saying for the school in general. I would have regretted it just because of um, I didn't do my research properly. So that's where I'm really trying to get you guys to get it in your brains. Research. So Marinello, I really liked it at first. And then I, you know, they kept on following up with me, which I think it's really great, actually, when people show an interest like that. But the location, the one that I personally live close to, it didn't look nice. It was pretty um, messy. Um, it was small. And they didn't have a classroom setting, which, you know, I really don't think that matters. I'm sure location-wise it doesn't matter. And I just seemed different. And I did think I wanted to go there. But after visiting... The next place I toured was actually Tony and Guy. So my tour was not the best, to be honest. I went when, you know, they were trying to work with my schedule, so I totally understand. I went when there was no students, which I got to see the studio being, I mean, not studio, salon being gorgeous. It was so clean and beautiful, and I fell in love right when I went there. Like, I didn't even think I was going to consider them that much when researching them, you know, but I fell in love. Um, the tour wasn't that amazing just because of, I didn't get to see students in class, but I did get to see their projects. I got to see everything. And I think she did a really great job giving me a tour and she really seemed to care. It wasn't more of the push into the door aspect. Um, 
she followed up with me as well. I think that's always a great thing, you know. She really seemed to really care if I got a great education. Um, but, you know, location-wise, I didn't... Driving there, I drove at night. It was just a scary experience. And, you know, as much as I really liked it, I actually read their information packet, and she told me, you know, we do so well on our testing. And, you know, after reading the information packet, there's some things I was, like, a little scared about. So that's where it kind of was, like, probably not Tony guy, but it's so beautiful. Like if you visit the location I, I live close to or not close to, it's like an hour away. Gorgeous. Like it seems like such a beautiful, like it seems like a real salon. It, the classrooms are so nice. Like everything there is so nice. And they do, you know, runways, I, I believe, you know, all these schools kind of do that. I don't think Marinello does, but, or at least I don't know if they did. They didn't tell me that. Um, but these places do high fashion like type things where I was just like, this is what I want to do. So it was pretty exciting looking. I saw some student projects. So Tony and D Guy did a great job. Then I went to Aveda. And like I said, guys, I've been crazy about Aveda since, you know, they have a different hour schedule. Most of these places will have like, if you're doing the full-time programs, it's like a nine to five um, for five days a week. This and I love working, you know, I'm going to need money during my job. And this location I'm actually considering does three days a week. And some, I could choose either Monday, Wednesday, Friday, or Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday. And then it's all day, pretty much. But you kind of get it out of the way. And I loved the fact that it was only three days, you know. And I wouldn't have to drive so much. So that was already a big, big sell for me. I was just like, this is different, first of all. And then I went to the location, you know, I tried looking really cute. I did my little outfit. I got so many compliments and it didn't seem ingenuine. Like I got so many like, you look so cute in your outfit. You should come here. Like we love it here. And you know, I didn't really get student interactions at any other location at that point. So it was really, really nice. I actually had a girl come up to me and cry and telling me how much she loved this. She, like, because I was just talking with one of the instructors. I was in one of the classrooms, and this girl was like, I really want to talk to her. And me and her ended up hugging, and it just was seemed, everyone was so nice there. And it was not fake. I had someone do, we made a perfume together. We did so much, like, and then the missions people, they were they really, you know, they were just trying to figure out if this is what I wanted, which I think is wonderful. It's not even like, they're like, tell me why you want this. And like I said, I went in there being confident. I'm like, this is what I want to do. I told them like how my plans are. And, you know, they, they're like, we don't need a recommendation letter from you. Um, we just like, we really think you are the Aveda fit. And they're like, we really hope you choose us. We understand you're going to Paul Mitchell tomorrow, but they were so sweet and it just, I walked out of there smiling. I was, I was like, this is it for me. I think this is it. So like I said, when you go to a location, you pretty much can get a great vibe. And you know, at Marinello, I did have that vibe and I did have that vibe at Tony and Guy, but this was so much different. It was just like realistic to me. I was like, I can be here. I was introduced to so many people. They, people talked to me and it wasn't like, they're looking at me like, oh, that girl's thinking about joining. No, they're like, are you going to join? You're so cute. You should join us. You know, like I was just like, Oh my gosh. Like it was, it was a great experience. So, um, next Paul Mitchell. So I was working that day and I was like, Oh my gosh. And I was going to be late. So I got there and gorgeous. Like, Oh my gosh. Like Aveda was beautiful too, but this place is huge. It was just like I told you, sometimes you can get sold by the salon. Like you're just like, wow. Everyone there was so good looking. They seemed like they knew what they were doing. You know, everyone, it just seemed so professional. It looked like a real salon. Like it just was amazing. I talked to this guy and, you know, he was really great. He really was talkative. Me and him were getting along. But, you know, I really did not feel like he provided me with information. I kept on having to ask questions, which is okay. You know, asking questions is great. But it wasn't the experience I had at Aveda. I really feel like they told me 
everything I needed to know. They were trying to make sure this is the decision I wanted to make. They want, they let me know this is what I wanted to do. And Paul Mitchell, you know, obviously they fill up so quickly and he let me know. He's like, if you want to go to another school, it's okay. And I liked that, you know, like that he wasn't trying to sell me because of, I don't like to be sold. Like, it's just not realistic to me. I feel like, you know, a couple of locations I went to, they were trying to sell me. So, um, you know, he, I was introduced to some people, didn't really talk to any students and, you know, they were really busy, obviously, but I went home like on the phone with my best friend and I was like, I don't know where to go. And then I told my boyfriend, I'm like, can you please research this? And I'm like, I don't know because of, I was really sold on the location. You know, the Paul Mitchell name is just a beautiful name to have with you. They have a beautiful everything, you know, obviously Aveda and Paul Mitchell, they're competing always and they're both so amazing. After researching it more, um, my friend researched it for to me too, my boyfriend and, you know, they're really hand in hand. It's really what you experience. It's really your personal preference. You know, you know, Marinello may be your fit. Tony and Guy may be your fit. Vena may be your fit. Or Community College or Paul Mitchell. Who knows? But I definitely decided. I, got, I decided a beta. I, I'm like smiling even thinking about it. Um, the reason why is just, it was just a warm environment. It just was probably the best day I've had in a really long time. They really cared about me and, you know, I didn't feel it, it, like it was ingenuine. I love everything they stand for and I just know it's what I want to do. So that's my experience. I know that was really long. I might make that um, a separate video. Who knows? But yeah, I'm going to go to Aveda. At least I'm, that's what I'm planning. I don't want to tell you guys something and then like it doesn't happen, but no. I'm pretty, pretty certain Aveda's for me. <laughs> so I love you guys as always. Um, if you have any questions, if you are considering a trade school or anything, let me know in the comments. I think it's awesome to like, you know, communicate with you guys because of, you guys are obviously people. <laughs> I'm a real person. You're real people. And I love to hear about your life. So. By the way, follow me on Instagram if you want to see my daily posts. I post pretty often. Um, you can see my outfits. You can see me and my boyfriend. You can see a lot of things. So it's down in the down bar. And I love you guys, like I said. So I'll talk to you soon. Bye.